What's going on guys? It's Wednesday. Wednesday night, halfway through the week. So hopefully everybody's staying on track with things they're trying to get done. They're staying they're being productive. Uh, I've got actually asked a couple of questions about people asking about weight loss and how they can improve on losing weight. Well, that's a whole another long fucking video about losing weight and what you have to do and how to calculate and figure shit out. So I'm gonna just gonna break it down for four simple, easy tips for you. And there are things that everybody, I'm gonna guess, already knows, but I'm gonna just here to reinforce it for you. So, for starters, if you want to lose weight, first off, so not part of the tips, but first off, if you wanna lose weight and you wanna go on a diet, that's your first mistake. You don't wanna go on a diet, you want to change your nutrition. Basically, think of it as a lifelong thing, you wanna change your nutrition. You don't wanna just go on a strict diet plan for four, eight, 12 weeks to achieve your goal of like whatever the scale says, you wanna lose 10 pounds and bam, you're now 10 pounds lighter. Then once that happens, you go off your diet and then you go fucking back to just eating junk food all the time and all you gain all that weight back. So you don't wanna have it be a diet, you wanna change your nutrition to change your lifestyle to improve yourself. So you're a healthier eater, you, that's what you want. You wanna have healthy eating habits. So first, that's the first thing for you to know to get in your own head, not diet, nutrition, change your, your nutrition lifestyle. But, so my first tip for you is you need to create um, that your exercise is a, going to be a daily habit. And I'm not saying every day you have to go to the gym, I'm saying every day you have to do some form of exercise. Go for a 30 minute walk, go to the gym, go to yoga, go do kickboxing, go do whatever. So you gotta make your first thing is it's gotta be a habit. and. So once you make it a habit, then your routine will be so much easier. Then you guys gotta figure out when, what your routine is. Like Monday, I'll do yoga. Tuesday, I do weightlifting. Wednesday, I go do kickboxing, whatever. Then you gotta figure out your routine for your whole week. So that's the first step, is figuring out your routine of fitness and how you're gonna fit fitness into your daily lifestyle. And fitness can be as short as 30 minutes. It doesn't have to be hours long, just so you all know. Then after that, you wanna then focus on, again, on nutrition. You wanna create healthy eating habits. So instead of always eating like granola bars, instead uh, eat some chicken, eat eggs. You wanna have lean sources of protein meats, and then, then you wanna combine that with small amounts of healthy carbohydrates for your body. That's what, that's what you want to be eating instead of fucking granola bars or going out to lunch and getting Taco Bell every fucking day. So that's your next step. You want to create healthy eating habits for you to go by every single day. And then once a week for starters, then throw in yourself a cheat meal to where you can go have that burger, you can go have some pizza, you can go get Taco Bell, whatever the fuck you want. So you want to create your healthy eating habits like that. And first tip on that, pantry. Get rid of all the fucking junk food you've got in your pantry. Get rid of it. Make it all sure it's all healthy food. That's your first thing. And then from there, you want to <clears throat> you want to create some sort of way to self-monitor yourself, like a journal. You could do a journal for yourself where you log every single day what you eat, what you do. So for that, um, I know there's an app. I think it's called My Fitness Pal, and I think that will actually you can track your. Uh, daily food intake with that so you can it's got i think it's even got a barcode scan so if you like go get like a granola bar you can scan the barcode it'll fucking read it right in for you if not you just got to go to the food search settings you can type in like boneless chicken breast from kroger and it'll bring it right up for you it's actually pretty good i mean i don't use it because mine's I, my diet's been my nutrition i guess has been this pretty much the same for, for a long ass time but for all the newcomers out there that'd be a way you can track everything is by is by using my fitness pal to monitor your your nutrition um fitness get a little fucking journal notebook write shit down every single day write down what you did and if you used a certain weight if you ran for a certain amount of time write it all fucking down and then week after week keep like you want to keep improving so if you ran a mile in 10 minutes Maybe the second week you wrote it, you ran a mile in nine minutes and 30 seconds. So you're getting better. You're showing improvements. That's what the journaling is for. So you can, you can, you have everything, you can monitor everything for yourself to check it all off to make sure you're staying on track. Um, 
because if you're if you if you're not staying on track with everything, you're really it's going to be kind of gambling and guessing all the time, and then that's just going to be a pain in the ass, and you're then gonna then you'll be kind of like losing hope. Because you're like, oh, I, I wasn't as strong as I was last week, but maybe you actually were as strong. You just don't remember because you didn't write it down. So get yourself a little journal, a little diary. If not that, on your, I'm sure you have an iPhone. It's so popular. There's the, there's the notes app. Use that. Write it all down in there. Um, last tip for you is to be consistent. Consistent being every single day of the week. That includes Saturday and Sunday, guys. Saturday and Sunday is when everybody wants to go off the fucking deep end and blow it out on the weekends and eat whatever the fuck they want. So you got to be consistent. Whatever you eat during the week and do it for fitness, do that on the weekends as well. There's my four tips for you guys. If you like it, want more, leave a comment below. If not, I'll see you guys tomorrow.